Pardon the interruption, y'all. Nice. All right, check it out. And this one right here was a little zesty. I gotta say, it's trying to get, it's trying to come off a little bourbon esque. So what I would like to do, I would like to run through them all one more game. And uh, just before I make my final decision to see which, boop, 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 boop. just give them one more, you know, one more try. Run through the middle one more game. First one, I know I, I absolutely love the nose is fantastic. Front phenomenal, mouth feel exceptionally phenomenal. Exceptionally, uh, whatever, whatever adjective I should do, but it's exceptional. It's, it's exceptionally exceptional. Exceptionally exceptional. And the finish just keeps on going. Don't do nothing to it. Just, don't don't bust it down. Don't bust it down. Just leave it the way it is. It's a plain Rolex. Just straight up and down. Mm -hmm. 
Lemon that are green. Lemons. 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 Now y'all be drinking water. Try something new. Nice chips. You know what I Them chips gonna sell you a ton on, you know, get them all them, them uh, taste buds. You know, you, you just rinsing them, rinsing your taste buds, but all that bullshit's doing your taste buds, you know. You eat your ice. Excuse me. It's not polite to talk with your mouth for. With a nice chip, you can roll it across your taste buds. Like it's like scraping your taste buds. Just something that you don't, you know, that me, myself, personally, that I've learned. You know, that water, you just, uh, with the, uh, that ice chip, you can uh, roll it across your tongue. You put some ink on the spot with your tongue. It's like real nice and clean. It's like a chalkboard. It's the purpose of watching men on Burger Man. You learn a lot. So we're gonna go with one. That's what we got. Boom. 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 That's the order. Let it be written. Let it be done. From my right to left. From your left to right. So in last place. We have number three, which would be Drum comes in last place. Johnny Drum, last place, and that's crazy. You know the reason I say that? 
is because Johnny Drum is one of my favorite freaking bourbons. Who the fucking thunk it? Last freaking place. That's fucking crazy. Johnny Drum. Wow, Bourbon Judge, you wasn't lying, bro. When you said it wasn't, wasn't shit, I said, man, you was crazy out your mind, man, but a blind don't lie. Wow. Coming in third place, we have number four. Kentucky Spirit? Man, I need my man Bourbon here with me, yo. This is crazy. Kentucky Spirit comes in third place. Wow. Wow. This is crazy, ladies and gentlemen. In second place, we have Second place is Bardstown Fusion. Second place. So leaving the winner to be Old Bardstown. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, listen here. I'm shocked. I'm gonna be honest with you. This is the second time I did this. I erased the first video because I said there's no way this could be true. But it happened again. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Old Barstown. A $30 bottle. Beat out the heavy hitters. That is nuts. But we don't lie over here. No man on bourbon, ladies and gentlemen. We don't make the news. We just report it. Unfreaking real. I'd have never thunk that. If you like this episode, please leave your comments below. Again, hit the like and subscribe button. Man, I'm your host, Cam, man, and I am sitting here totally fucked up right now. Always in part, if you can't encourage anyone to drink bourbon, then you're discouraging them from the fine things of life. On behalf of all the men on bourbon, peace. And until next time, Have a good time. We out. Old fucking Bardstown, yo. Know?